Welcome back. Joining us right now is someone very special to my heart and to West Virginians, Madeline Collins, Miss West Virginia. Hello. Thank, Thank you, you for so having me. Thank you for coming <laughs> and being a part of our show, but not only a part of the show, but a part of the expo. So tell me, you've been here for a couple of uh, hours already. What is? What are you feeling? How does it feel to be a part of the Women's Expo this year? It feels incredible. You know, being Miss West Virginia, I have the greatest job of traveling our great state of West Virginia. Um, but I'm, I love any time I can come back to the southern part of the state, which is home to me, um, and support my people and support the things that we love to do. And so, tell me, obviously, I, w I just want to talk about it. Just one question, yeah. on it, because you were you were on the Miss America stage. How did it feel being a part of that? And you're still a part of that, obviously. But right. How did it feel? You know, competing at Miss America is phenomenal. It was a phenomenal experience. But to have West Virginia across my chest is an experience that I'll never forget. You know, dancing on that stage, talking on that stage, sharing my passions and my dreams. And what I want to do, you know, as my job as Miss West Virginia is, is incredible. And I still can't believe I did it. <laughs> and Madeline, I've seen you walking around. I've seen the little girls just yes. in awe of the crown and the sash. Yeah. Um, and even some grown women, too, you know. There's nothing wrong with a crown and a sash, right. regardless of how old you are. Um, what would you say to encourage them if they're not necessarily feeling encouraged? This is about this event is about empowerment. What would you say to encourage those girls and women out there? You know, empowered women truly empower women. But the thing to remember is that I was not, I'm not a pageant girl. Miss America was never in hindsight for me. Um, but if I can do it, they can do it too. And so what's important is to follow your dreams, no matter what they may be, big or small, follow them, you know, follow suit. That's some great advice, yeah. Madeline. Thank you so much Thank you for, for having me. With us. Thank you. And keep it here because we've got that final forecast right after the break.